He who controls the weather will control the world. If I made a decision, or if there was a collective decision, to do a geoengineering program, and you put, say, uh, the kind of program I think makes more sense, is put about a million tons a year in, but let's say, you might end up killing many tens of thousands of people a year as a direct result of that decision. I think that has moral consequences. I don't sweep it under the rugs. This is a case where I take this much differently from Alan and think it's a much more serious issue. In the 90s, the Army admitted to Cold War spraying and even confessed to planting a cover-up that they were testing a smokescreen to protect cities in case of an aerial attack from the Soviet Union. The Army insisted the spray was harmless. This was linked to the development and testing of weaponized radiation. Sociologist Lisa Martino-Taylor has spent years researching the St. Louis testing and has gathered thousands of now declassified documents. She says cadmium would have been toxic enough, but government documents show a link between the St. Louis testing and military-funded human radiation experiments. The military now admits to some horrific Cold War human experiments around the country. A handful of hospital patients were secretly injected with plutonium. Babies and pregnant women unknowingly received radioactive iodine. And from 1946 to 1953, 73 mentally disabled children in Massachusetts were fed oatmeal containing radioactive calcium. Yet much of what happened in St. Louis remained shrouded in secrecy. Not only was data missing, uh, data had been deleted. In 1972, the government destroyed pruitt Igo. What is it that made this study so classified that they're still not talking today about it? All right, guys, welcome to another episode of Chemtrails Coast to Coast and Around the World. Tonight, the word is chemtrails. There are some out there that do not like the word chemtrail. Well, no matter how you look at it, there are chemicals and heavy metals coming out of that exhaust. Now, I'm not talking about the spraying, just the exhaust. And I'll name a few of those. Sodium, magnesium, potassium, calcium, scandium, titanium, strontium, barium, chromium, aluminum, sulfur, and lead, and much more. All right, so if someone says to you contrails are just condensation, a good response would be condensating on what? And the answer would be, cloud seeds are aerosols like soot and heavy metal nanoparticulates. Knowledge is power. Use it wisely. All right, let's get onto your photos. Vi Nugent from Winnipeg shares these photos of something lighting up her sky, along with another object that appears to be moving around this cluster of lights. Could it be some sort of drone or an orb? I've seen these things before, and that's for another video, but tell me what you think in the comments. Now the lights themselves reminded me of a video I recently saw out of China showing something very similar. And using what I know, I would say these are sounding rockets being used to deliver chemical payloads high into the ionosphere. That being said, there are many things happening in our sky, some things we know about, and other projects may take decades to declassify. But we don't have decades. Greg Bush from Sydney, Australia says his son is getting hijacked. And Kent Rayleigh captures this halo in Arizona. Candace Jones in Ontario shares a bucket of fresh rainwater. Here's a jar of that. I'm not gonna drink that and I really don't like the idea of it falling on my garden. Moving on, Kim Bear from Glendale, Arizona says Chemtrail Kitty, do you see it? Bobby Carter shares a smoky sun in West Virginia. And Jessica Taylor Fox shares this beautiful shot from Big Sky Country, Montana. Nikki Reeve in Victoria, British Columbia shares this image of a completely obscured sun. All right, guys, we have plenty of more photos to look at. Set the music for your viewing and listening pleasure. So until next time, keep looking up.
Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief There's something that'll have what you need what you mean? We're broken, it's tragic We're not all elastic But maybe there's magic Believe you could have it And I know of sadness The anxious and panic The infinite vastness Of all that is blackness Oh,